Hello all. Alright, not sure if the camera's working or not. We'll just pretend it is. It's been having some difficulties with the uh, record button. So I've been looking for new cameras to replace this one. This is a semi-pro camera and there's no replacements for them. All you do is get the cheapy things. So all it's about available. That's all it seems to be available is uh, something with a little bit of zoom, and sh it's supposed to be better video. But I don't think it's as good as the video I do on here. But we'll see if this thing works or not. We'll try and coax as long life out of it as we can before we go and buy another one. Nobody services cameras anymore, at least not these, and uh, there's no replacement for this good a quality of a camera, and still have super zoom and all that and the convenience of not having to carry lenses in a dangerous area where you don't want to be carrying lenses. People go after you with lenses. <laughs> so we'll go up here and do the video. Okay, hopefully this is working. Ascend Performance Materials, the largest emitter of nitrous oxide. One thing I like to do is call companies when they say they're going to green up their company, the bullshit, because most of them don't. They say they're going to, right, and they give a date and all this, but they never do. This is an example of what I'm talking about. Nitrous oxide is 300 times more powerful than CO2. So this company is still emitting significant amounts of N2O after they promised that they would uh, reduce it. They pledged to cut emissions, but they didn't, of course. What do they do with N2O? Is It is added to adaptic acid, a key ingredient in nylon and polyurethane. N2O is a super polluter. Ascend vented 27,528 tons in 2020. The plant is in Pensacola, Florida. That is more than five times the N2O than any other U.S. plant emits. N2O is the most ozone depleting substance there is. N2O is not regulated under the Clean Air Act in the U.S. Company officials said it is moving to cut emissions by 2020, but has increased emissions by 50% in 2021. Now, isn't that just typical of these companies? They say, "Oh no, we're green. We're gonna we're gonna clean up our act and all this." And guess what they do? They increase the output because they think people aren't watching or or, or paying attention. But some of us are paying attention, and that brings me to yesterday's video. I had a video that uh, asked how your weather and climate was around where you live. Is it warmer, cooler, rainier, whatever? And I got a huge response all over the world. Really nice. And a lot of people say the same thing. A very warm spring and unusually nice weather. Well, some are having major flood. So, uh, I have to keep these short so that the camera will continue to work and I don't want to wear it out too fast. So, what about uh, plants where you live? Are you finding that they, uh, they say one thing but do just the opposite? Typical of corporate America. Typical of the deep state. If you really want to know what the deep state is, it's these corporations. It's not Nancy Pelosi or any politician. It's it actually is these corporations and the way they get away with what they get away with. Constantly polluting even though they promise and pledge otherwise. Because people forget. They, they don't want to really pay attention. I mean, so what? <laughs> right? They can say anything. Talk is cheap. We find that on our, our leaders all the time. And the uh, Russia invasion is still pending. Hopefully Something will happen where that won't happen, but it uh, doesn't look good. 
your comments, your ups, your downs, your new subscribers. And until next time.